music producer, studio engineer, and self-styled dubplate king. He's had countless reasons to smile at present, considering the fact that he has been nominated, alongside DJ Khaled, for a whopping five Grammy Awards. The music producer who acted as DJ Khaled's official engineer on his Grammy-nominated God Did album says he feels honored, honored and advises other engineers to use his success as a lesson in terms of securing the credit they deserve for their creative work. Let's welcome to talk about five Grammys and his music in general, Pantason, to share more. So big up God, God above all things. Big up God. Yeah, man, God above all things. Man. And that's a mighty thing. That's so we put God first before me. You understand? And the blessings come yeah, man, after. Yeah, the blessing come after. You know, before you enter a room, you know, say, big up God. You know, all of the yeah. way that's clear for you. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That's so interesting. <laughs> that's so interesting. Because you know what I think? I think some people think that people who are in the secular space, so mm -hmm. to speak, mm -hmm don't have spirituality, they're not connected to the divine, that you have to be singing about God in your music or do Christian music to actually acknowledge God. But that's not, no, that's because, not the case. Yeah, you see, sometimes in life, the real people them, where, 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 where mm. don't do it in private. Mm. You understand? We don't really go out and, and preach. We just keep a covenant with God because, you know, that's what's important. It's Make not about how it looks to everybody. It's not about how it looks. It's the yeah, actual it's relationship. Actual relationship. Yeah, that's right. well, well, yeah. Let's talk about your music. You come from a rich We're going to start there. Yeah. We're going to start from your so legacy. Been nine time world champion, Pink Panther. You understand? Panther's son. Yeah, man. Panther's son. So, <laughs> so, me get the name. Exactly. You see, Pink Panther from Black Cat. You know, he's known for winning the most world class titles overall. Wow. You understand me? Aisha and Chin print all billboard with that and show you. Panther win the most. You understand? So from that, people expecting greatness. Yes. You understand? Just a lineage of greatness. I entered the business as a duplicate agent. You At understand? what age? Well, would you say what age? Me in the business around the studio a long time. But from leave high school, it's just focus on music, you know, the school online, music, studio wow. every day. What yeah, was it like growing it. up in an environment where your father is all over the place, just just shelling everything, just winning titles and just doing music in that way that Jamaica has become known for back in the day? All right, you see, you see, it it two things. Mm -hmm. It it put a lot of pressure on me to be great because everybody say, "Yo, Panther son, that." Yeah, that's what I say. And then secondly, it it motivated me if you know, say so me can do the same thing or even better. Mm -hmm. You understand? Not maybe not in the same field, mm -hmm. but. As a person, yes. you know, I can evolve to be, you know, a superstar. All right, so you say you started now doing dubs. Right out of mm -hmm. high school, you just went into music. Yeah, just straight into music. Because you say Calabar, you know, Calabar is a school where only a great artists come from, only a great people. You know, the musical background of Calabar is strong. Mm -hmm. So from I go Calabar, you just, I go, it's, it's just automatic feel of music. I just saw me feel. We don't know about nobody <laughs> else, but we don't see like, say, from I go Calabar, yeah, automatic, yeah man, Massacre, Vibes Cartel, you name it, next startups, you see me? So, it's just, you know, from Seaview Garden, Calabar, so the whole rich heritage of music and everything, and I'm a person, I love computers, I love um, mm. designing apps, my mind don't look like the computer geek, but, you know, I designed my, my, my first website, I designed my own website, you know, I've never had anybody design a website for me, I love research, as I say, I'm curious about everything, I love research, design my own website, you know, set up my business the proper way. Right. You understand? So it, everything that you do, you have to research about mm -hmm. it. You understand? Audio engineer, I never went to school for it. Mm -hmm. You understand what I say? It's just trial and error. You see me? So me don't nobody feel like say, oh yes, me can say, oh I went to this college for no. Just just time spent yeah, man. doing the work. Yeah man, I literature and history and chemistry and wooly for them subject. <laughs> yeah, kind of vibe, but we never do no 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 music uh, in high school, but the love for music yes. is there and in my community at Seaview Gardens, you know, all the great artists come from this or two. Mm -hmm. So so you see heritage. My father surrounded by and it. we're surrounded by it. Yes. You understand? So the influence is very strong. Mm -hmm. It's just how you absorb the influence and then find a spot for yourself. Ah. It's so interesting that you said that because there are so many other people who grow up around strong influences, mm -hmm. but they're not able to establish themselves, as you say, in the right way, right way. in a way that, that protects their creativity, as you said. Yeah, Tell me about, yes, how did you know what to do differently so that you could now be getting the credit you deserve? All right, you have to, you have to do what you love. Hmm. Because me realize this now, 
I find out, say, I enjoy being around the computer, I enjoy the creative process of the music, I enjoy behind the scenes, I enjoy creating the music overall. So literally the engineering, yeah, yes. the, and the, the yeah, architecture behind it. The architecture it. behind it. Okay. Me's a boy, you know, we, we record from, from the duplets. We used to record duplets and then go in at the dance and watch the reaction. Like if we got a world crash and watch my father play the duplets when we just record. You understand what I say? Mm -hmm. So you see the feeling there. I just feel good and say, geez, one piece, this is so nice, see? You know? <laughs> <laughs> the feeling, you know, you just see, mm. you know, you feel like a newborn baby, you just put out. When you see how mu music moves people, yeah, man. when you see the reaction to the work you create. Yeah, you know? so it's just a feeling there. Me don't know how to explain a feeling there. You see, when you love something, mm -hmm. you know, that's the only time you get that feeling there. Mm -hmm. You know, if you just do it for money, you now get the feeling. How did you meet Khalid? Khalid, Instagram. Stop it. Yeah, man, Instagram. No, mm. Actually, I was in, uh, I'm going to tell you how it's going out. DJ Khalid, you know, in, in, my always, uh, five years now, me I DM Khalid. Five years. You've been DM DM him. him. That's what I'm telling you them, so don't give up. DM Khalid, five years, say, yo, Panther son, me that love to work with her, Ray, Ray, Ray. Oh, my God. I was goodness. in Canada um, one summer with my friend, uh, Monica, and we're in a car, convertible, playing the song he produced with Movado, Sizzler, and everybody. So I was playing it and, and I tag him in it and then he repost it. And then he said, he said to me that from the day that he reposted that video, he started to follow me and then realizing who I am and what I do because I used to, I voice no plates in the car during the whole of COVID because nobody could go to the studio. So he just find that to be very interested to how I adapt to the times and, you know. So he's saying, follow me for about a year. You know, and then one day I just see a text coming by Instagram says, so send me a number. Is it me? Oh my God. That's it. But it wasn't, I stress out. <laughs> it feels like it could be looked at as overnight success. It could be like, send me a number. But it's been years. Yeah, in five making. years. So when he, he said, when he opened the DM to text me, he sent me about a message. So it just, it just concreted in his mind and said, yo, this person. Has been wanting, yeah, to wanting to link with me, so this is the right decision, you know. Oh my goodness! Yeah, man. So sometimes we just always tell people, say, just if I'll Rihanna, my DM Rihanna, I'm still away for the reply. Yeah, man. I pray the same <laughs> blessing that came to you with Khaled will come to you concerning <laughs> Riri. But from DMing, exchanging numbers to know being a student, yeah, an engineer, an audio I, engineer I, I on actually this album. worked on Khalid Khalid, you know, the first first project I worked on was the one before God did. Wow. Yeah, because he reached out to me and said, yo, all right, I have this idea, you know? Because yeah. I'm a person, first I started out voicing dub plates for him. Right, right, right. He right. linked me, say, yo, Panta, I see you doing the dubs. I wanted to get some more dubs because dubs inspire him to create. Mm. You understand? Because that's what I'm saying, dub plate has a very integral part in everything. Because if you can put Capitan and Sizzler together upon a dub plate, and you say, yo, this sound wicked. Mm -hmm. So imagine all them sound and a song. You know, so it's That's like a trial, yeah, yeah, trigger. yeah. Gotcha. So that plate is like the blueprint to a 45. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, my kid in the 90s, Bounty Killer used to DJ songs on that plate that he has never sung, you know? So a that plate kind of tests the waters and then you just go all out. We could continue talking all, all morning. <laughs> it's, it's feel like a treasure trove of knowledge and just stories to inspire. Yeah, but man. we have to wrap up. Congratulations on five Grammy nominations. Yeah, Congratulations on your tenacity and your stick to itness that paid off. Yeah, man, it and paid off. And before we leave, more make the people know say, we have a charity called Big Up God Foundation. You know, me and, and my entertainment co workers are coming together, for example. You know, where each artist is donating a dub plate to the, the school that he used to go to to develop the, the music, music department. You know, so that's my, because in everything that you get from, you have to yes, give back. Yes, yes, yes. You know, music feed me, music make me into the person I am today. Mm -hmm. So I have to invest back into the future generation of music. And giving them back. Yes, yeah, so. Panther Sun is here, man. So. How can people follow you to stay in touch with all of your excitement all on, right, on the um, media? Due to the, the fact that I have only a fake page on social media, I only do music on my website, okay. www.pantherson.com. All right, you heard it here. Yeah, man. Thank you so much for joining us.